Hey there folks, bringing you an OU battle today against Polyboy15 of Smogon. Um, this team is also revised for Black and White too, but again, I have not really placed any of the Pokemon. The only uh, Pokemon that has any differences at all, really, is my Caracosta, which now carries Low Kick and is running a full-on physical set rather than um, a mixed set or a special set as I've run in be uh, before. Um, Karakas is definitely the Pokemon that I've revised the most on this team. But anyway, I lead off with Donphan. I see that my opponent's got a Sun team going, and I want to get those rocks up, um, considering he does have that Volcaron on the team. Now, Bronzong actually goes for the screens. I was expecting him to set up rocks, he didn't, which I thought interesting. So I go straight out into uh, Tachikoma, my Rotom um, heat uh, form, thinking I can just hit it with an overheat. Uh, it specs. It should take him out, even with the uh, light screen, I would think. Uh, I'll put up a calc in the... Uh, annotations to tell you whether... I mean, that seems like awfully low damage to me. Anyway, he goes ahead and goes for Gyro Ball. Um, doesn't do Jack. I mean, 4x resisted. <laughs> really kind of a stupid move. Anyway, I go ahead and switch out into Jirachi, thinking he, I probably wall him completely with Jirachi. So, Jirachi's out. He goes out into Tentacruel on the same turn, so I'm like, okay, this is actually interesting because I carry the Psy Shock, and maybe I can take out this Tentacruel um, before it Rapid Spins. Um, so I get it down to below half. Rather impressed. He actually goes for the Skull first turn. Um, was not expecting that. I guess he's hoping for the burn, thinking that I was um, an Iron Head burn set. But anyway, uh, Reflect is now down. I'm like, huh, okay, so Psyshock should now KO, right? Uh, I don't exactly know. It doesn't work out that way. It looks like... Um, yeah, it doesn't look like uh, Reflect actually lowers uh, damage from Psyshock. It looks like the light screen is doing that. But hey, the light screen shouldn't last too much longer either. Now the light screen's off. I can just go for the Thunderbolt to get the easy KO just in case he switches back into Bronzong. Um, so that is a dead, uh, that is a dead Tentacruel. And um, I mean, I got to worry about you know, the rocks are gone, but I can just try to set them up later. So now Alk is going to come Nine Tails. I decide to stay in and go for Wish. See what he's going to go for. Try to scout out the set. He goes for Flamethrower. Um, Jirachi actually takes that rather well. Uh, does a bit over half, but not that much over half. So I've got a wish up in the air, and something I can switch out, go out into Donphan, and possibly uh, I can recover enough HP with that wish that I'll be back up at sturdy range and be able to guarantee that I get up my um, Stealth Rocks again. So indeed, that works out because I'm going to be up to sturdy after leftovers. So that's so incredibly awesome. Uh, Nine Tails is now going to go for Solar Beam. I think that actually does less damage than Flamethrower. Again, I'll put up the calcs. Um, yeah, I mean, it got me to down to basically the same point. Uh, you know, you lose stab and you lose the boost from the sun, even though you gain a little bit of base power. So, I'm now up to about half. Um, Flamethrower, I'm expecting to take me out. Um, amazingly, it doesn't. I survive on four and go for the Earthquake, so that was probably min damage right there. But you know what? I'm fairly happy. I take out his Ninetales. Uh, useless crit, I would assume, but, you know, I'll put up the calcs. And so, Peanut is doing work, down to 28 HP. I was gonna come to Cesar and decide, you know what, rather than sacrifice my Donphan... Oh, I guess I do decide to sacrifice my Donphan. I was gonna say, maybe I'll save him for later, uh, because it does have that priority. Ice Shard, which would be useful against several of his Pokémon. Um, but no, I switch out here, I get a free switch out here into Tachikoma. Um, not free switch out, but basically... Tachikoma is fine to be out here. Sun boosted specs overheat, 4x effective. This is overkill by any means. Scissor is down. I was really expecting him to switch out into someone else, um, but I guess he figured no one would really want to take a specs overheat in the sun. So now it's going to come Volcarona. And here, he's down to half. Um, even though my special attack is down to minus two, it is the sun. And so I counted and I was like, this should KO, but I forgot that he was going to quiver dance. And so now I really don't know whether this is going to KO. Um, again, calculations will be up in the annotations. I do manage to take him out with an overheat that was no crit, no nothing. That is fantastic. Now out is going to be Lilligant. Um, he actually just, he goes for Sleep Powder here. Uh, okay, good move, I guess. Um, but now that's his Sleep Fodder. He can't put anyone else to sleep, and so I'm going to switch Tachikoma out. Expect him to go for the Quiver Dance on the Switch. He's got two Quiver Dancers. And indeed, he does go for the Quiver Dance. Dragonite is out. Um, Fire Punch in the Sun is, you know, considering both of his Pokemon should be weak to fire, I think I should be safe to just go for the Fire Punch. He goes to the Sleep Powder again, and I, I'm in the Smogon chat with him, and I say to him, What the hell did you just do? You just broke Sleep Claws. It didn't matter because I had Lumbear, but you can't do that. He's like, Whatever, this isn't an official battle. And I told him, It doesn't matter. You will get banned if you do that. Uh, and you're you're damn lucky that I don't care too much. So here, uh, last Pokemon, I'm gonna go for the Fire Punch, 
And this is actually kind of interesting in that doesn't KO. I think he must be running Heatproof. That's the only way this makes sense. But yeah, Dire Ball ain't gonna do jack, especially considering he didn't bother going for the Dragon Dances. So now another Fire Punch is going to take him out, and that is good game. So good game, Polly Boy. Um, again, don't break Sleep Claws. That's just a douchebag move. So comment, rate, subscribe, and challenge. So long, folks.